Hi Gary, this is Luke from Pacific Toyota and Lexus of Cairns. I just sent you to do the video tour of our 2009 Toyota Land Cruiser Troop Carrier. So mate, I'll start at the front of the vehicle. Obviously you can see it is fitted with your genuine Toyota steel bull bar. So the great thing is it is a steel bull bar, so really, really strong. And then you can see down here it is fitted with a winch. So that's a bonus, you know, a couple of grand's worth just there. Got your Haller spotlights there. Apologise, it is a little bit dusty. We're actually rebuilding our new car showroom across the road. So mate, the dust from the building just comes and sits over on the cars. But mate, it is in really good condition, this troop carrier. Now a few tiny little marks, you know, on the bull bar. It's a bit of a scratch along there. This is just dust on there. So I apologise about, about the dust on it. Bonnet in really good condition. A few tiny little stone chips I'll point out. One there, one there. I think there's one that's been touched up just over here. That's being really fussy. You can see all in here is in nice and clean. That's a good giveaway. Usually they've done a lot of hard work. It's uh, made pretty visible by looking in there. Got your Dunlop tyres on the uh, all round. Front tyres probably about 80%. You can see nice and nice and clean under there. Left hand side of the vehicle, very, very clean. Not really any scratches or anything like that to point out on the on the passenger side of the Troopy. Got your rear tire here. Say so probably about 60%. Obviously got your V8 D4D turbo diesel. Badge there. Okay, take you to the back. Got your tow bar on the back with all your trailer plug wiring. Fairly standard, they always have, you know, a few scratches just on the on the back here. That's fairly normal. Just from people jumping in and out with boots on and stuff like that. All right, we'll open up the back. So it does have a second spare tire as well. It's just in, inside the vehicle. Tiny little bit of a crack here on the rear, rear cover. Under the doors is really good. Little crack just here. The back of the vehicle is very good. You can see the hood lining. Definitely wasn't a mine vehicle. You can see it, you know, doesn't have any roll roll bars or anything like that. A lot of these are mine vehicles, so it's good to know that ours isn't. Ours was actually purchased through a private owner in Townsville. So we bought this one off someone uh, in Townsville who was selling it. Got your spare tire there. All the seats and seat belts and the back of the car's in, in you know, pristine condition for a troop carrier. Sometimes they get a little bit bit worn you know the car the, the vinyl flooring and the seats and stuff those this one is in really good condition I'll close it up and you do have a second spare wheel like I said okay take you down the driver's side very good condition as well you can see the paint's really nice and glossy as well I did just want to point out a few little marks on the driver's door so there's your standard little marks just along here and then there's just a few stone chips you know like there's one here now one's been touched up here, little stone chip there, I think there's one, two just here. And there's so a few little marks that have been touched up on the driver's door, but other than that, really good condition. You can see it is fitted with your genuine Toyota snorkel, got your side steps there. So, mate, you know, all the imperfections, you know, they're mainly all on that, on that driver's door, so very good. Under the doors and everything, I know you wanted to have a look under there. They're all like new. Nothing to point out there. Okay. Do have your turbo timer here, so that shows the previous owners did look after the car. Obviously you got your vinyl flooring. Sorry about it, it is a little bit dirty. Vinyl flooring, vinyl seats, really nice and easy to keep clean. Okay, we'll jump inside here. 
All right, driver's door card, very good. You know, usually they get a bit of wear there from people resting their arms and stuff like that. Got cruise control, so that's a bonus. Not many of them are fitted with cruise control. Like I said, turbo timer. Dash in very, very good condition. It's just been serviced, so you don't need to service it until 71,000 Ks. Now it is a three-seater. All the seats are in great condition. The interior in this thing is immaculate. It is um, in great condition. Got three keys, so that's a bonus. And you got your log books here as well, so um, that's all also a bonus. It has, you know, good service history. You can see here, 10,000, 20,000, 24, 28, 31, and we've done one at 61 at Pacific Toyota. So, mate, awesome log books. Inside, very, very good. Now, I'll start it up for you. Grab the keys. Give it a bit of a rev. Running very well. Do have your air conditioning controls here. Handbrake, gear sticks. Got your Bluetooth, so you can answer your phone all off the off the head unit here. Got USB and auxiliary connection as well. Aircon's nice and cold. All right, I'll just pop the bonnet and I'll show you in the engine bay. I'm just going to put the phone down for two seconds because these bonnets are fairly heavy. Trying to do it one-handed is difficult. All right, here we go. You can see here how clean the engine bay is, you know. That's always a giveaway around that, that bonnet scoop there, there's red dirt, all that kind of stuff around there, which there isn't. Engine bay very clean. Okay, thanks very much for watching and uh, we'll be in contact soon.